Everybody, it's... put down your Zeldas. Put down your Zeldas. I know some of you are holding Zeldas right now, and I want you to drop. Zeldas. Who's holding Zeldas? Oh, this, I gotta put this here. Who's holding Zeldas? If you're holding Zelda, you need to drop your Zelda right now. Drop put it on Zeldas. the ground. Ooh. I'm facing away from the camera because Joy's in my lap. And if you turn, Joy might fall. There she is. There she is. And I Nathan rotate, is here. And I'm, and I'm here physically in Nathan the room. Nathan is physically here in the room. There she is. Because we're doing a board game night tonight. Because we're freaking hanging out like friends. We're hanging out like friends after this. I made cookies. Julia made cookies, but and you haven't Karina's baked them yet. Karina's not invited. Karina's not invited <laughs> because she left. She left. Town. She's out of town. But you know who is invited? Some of you might remember... Zelda. Well, Zelda is invited, <laughs> but some of you might remember Randy. Y'all remember Randy? Randy! You remember Mark? And Randy? You remember Mark and Randy from streams? From streams? From like the old office Twitch streams? They're coming over. There's a oh, lot of schools out. A lot of children Friday, are yelling. Friday afternoon school's out. That's yeah. a big one. It's Time a big one. to go outside one. and scream. It's, you know, summer Fridays, baby. We're in it. We're in it and we're going to win it. This is patron drawing day. Patron drawing day. That was a good little dumpling. Thanks for being a patron. Thank you for being a patron. That's another good looking dumpling. That one is a little. That's like the one I made in the class. Ooh, it's a bean. Squeep. 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 Aww. It's a bean bird. Squeep. Yeah. Squeak. Yeah, I like the vibes right now. Squeak. It's summer. Jacob's just making noises and drawing little bean character. Julia's got a cat in her lap. Squeak. It's I, good. I literally just got here because the G train is not running to its usual stops, and I didn't realize that until I was already at the G train station, so I had to improvise. Isn't that fun? But we're here. We're here and we're having fun. It was a horse the whole time. This is the unevolved form of Jacob horse. This is like the baby form. It's not like a an anomaly form. No, this one is the one you it, find first. Okay. Where, wow, where you rare, have, it hatches out of an egg. A rare young Jacob horse. Here's the egg. Jacob pony? A Jacob foal? Jacob foal? Jacob Foley. Jacob Fowl. Jacob Fowl. Y'all are being ridiculous right now. Yeah, we got ridiculous energy right now. For the I wish patrons. you would take this seriously. For the patrons and for Zelda. This horse just hatched and none of you are taking care of it. Where's I, this steed in Zelda? I this hope, ain't any of Zelda's. I hope people are still excited about Zelda in a couple weeks. Why wouldn't they be? I just hope they are. Not for any reason in particular. I just hope so. We just hope so. And I hope uh and I hope that it's fun to play the game Zelda. I'm going to play the game Zelda next week. I'm gonna, I bought it. I'm going to play it over the weekend probably. This weekend Diablo is weekend. Diablo 4 server slam. Oh, you're right. I'm doing that instead. And so I'm going to slam the servers. How do you how do you slam the servers? I shouldn't this isn't this isn't this the, is for the time is, nor the place. We'll talk about that later. Um, I just got excited. <laughs> I just got excited and forgot I was doing a, a show for an audience and just wanted to talk yeah, about just Diablo. To just just chat, just shoot the shit. Yeah, I'll slam some servers with you though, for sure. Um, what, what would you, do you, what would you... You need to draw a mug. Do you, what would you... You drew a horse instead of a mug. And then you need to get a suggestion. Well, that's what I was trying to get, but you told me I had to draw a mug. So I now see. I'm doing that. You see, you just seemed confused. What about <laughs> what I was saying made <laughs> you me seem seemed confused? A little, <laughs> you just seemed a little confused. Did so I not I... seem perfectly in control? <laughs> but we can get those suggestions rolling in while the mug happens. Oh, he's got a butt. He's got a little front butt. 
Oh, it's like a little baby Digimon going. Rum, 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 rum. Stop hitting your face on the microphone. I'm Joy, sending you, that to Joy. You can hit your face on the microphone if you want. Do you want to hit your face on the microphone? Oh, she's leaving. That's how you have to get her. You have to tell her that she's allowed to do it. And then she's like, now I don't want to. No, I don't want to anymore. Like, Jacob, these interested. are good drawings. Yeah, today. this is fun. Very loose. Thank you. Very loose and summary. For um, a loose and summary stream. I drew Ganondorf on the last stream we did. Yeah. It was the last drawing of the last stream. That VOD is up on YouTube right now. I simply can't draw another Ganondorf so soon. I'm still in my Ganondorf refractory period. That's I have to fair. wait a full week before I can draw another one. You know what I don't think I've seen you draw, which seems like a crime? What? A, a, a Gerudo lady. A, a Gerudo, Gerudo lady. lady. I mean, that seems right up your alley. Yeah. I do love, you know why I haven't done it is that I don't think I can do them justice. That's a strong lady who want to crush you. I bet you could do it. I bet I, you could draw like a nice shapey lady. I love them. What's the name of the one from Breath of the Wild? The, like the. The, the one. The one? The, the big one. You one. Get, the one you get the power from? Yeah, the big one. The big one, the big lady. The Herbosa. Big, the big lady. Herbosa. Herbosa is so freaking cool. Yeah. Yeah, see, I can't do this. Draw your own. Draw draw an, an OC Gerudo lady, and that way you're not beholden to any design constraints besides big lady. I don't think I can do it. I don't think I have it in me today. All right. Wow. All right. Okay. That's like the opposite... A lady that looked like that and is that sharp, she's like the opposite of how I draw. I'd have to really think about it. Then draw something else. I'm gonna draw something else. But you know, if anyone in chat wants to draw a big lady, I support them in their endeavor. What am I drawing? What am I drawing? It's so loud outside. Yeah, today. it's freaking summertime. It's not. The weather gets nice and everyone's like time to be as loud as possible. I keep saying it's it it feels like summer. It's a summer day. We yeah. got like we got like a summer weekend at the start of March and then it's been winter again. And now it's summer all of a sudden again. I will draw a Goron. Yeah. I can yeah. I can definitely do that. That's in my wheelhouse today. Yeah. I mean, just... you saw what I've drawn. I've drawn two dumplings. That's true. Essentially. You're, like, in a, you're in a dumpling mood. Like today, you want me to draw Urbosa? That's simply not possible. You just like the Gerudo lady so much. <sighs> yeah. I yeah. like her too much. It's hampering my ability to... It stunned you. Yeah, I can't... I can't be... I can't be. I simply can't be. It's like those people you see and you're like, oh, you're like intimidatingly good looking. Yeah. I mean, not to say that the Goron is not also intimidatingly good looking Yeah, in but their it's, own special way. It's like you see this one, you're like, I must sketch you. Yeah. yeah. Sometimes it's like, I, I can't. I simply can't put to paper, to canvas this beauty and sometimes it's like I must put to canvas this beauty. <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm filled with an overwhelming need and to it's do it. just it's it just depends on how you're feeling in that moment in that moment in that day this could also be the onion night oh yeah it could be as of, yeah. as of right now if I just did like like this yeah there he is Wow what if the Onion Knight hung out with a Goron? What it if? Might, it might go a little something. I'm not doing that. Oh. <laughs> it might go a little something. It it won't go a little something like anything. He'd be, you know, because the Gorons live in like the volcano area, so that onion's gonna get a little, little caramelized. You know what I'm saying? I, you know, I do know what you're saying. That's the thing about it. 
Might be a little little tasty little grilled onion. I didn't get to get a, a burger on my way here since I didn't walk from the subway station. I, I just... Do you want a hot dog? Do I want a hot dog? Yeah, do you want a hot dog? Right now? Yeah. <laughs> do you, are you offering me a hot dog? Oh, or we you have just, hot dogs. Are you, just, you, you have hot dogs? Yeah. Well, they're not... They're not prepared. I mean, they're prepared in the sense that all hot dogs are prepared. Which I don't. Is I don't want a cold hot dog. No. Do you want me to heat you up a hot dog? No. I mean, we're st <laughs> we're, we're, we're streaming. <laughs> we sort of. I don't, got I don't some... want you to. I don't want you to leave the stream to go heat me up a hot dog. But thank you for the offer. That's very kind. We got some stuff going on at the moment. Unless, Can... yeah. I mean, let you know what. Let's go in the other room and talk about the server slam and eat up <laughs> eat some hot, hot dogs. dogs and just <laughs> leave the stream going. And maybe people can like catch yeah. little little tidbits. If they listen very hard. Yeah. If you listen very hard. I mean, on the last Twitch stream, we, we came up with some very high concept stream ideas. So I think that one... That could fit right that in. That could fit right in, especially for like a Patreon stream where it's like we already, we already freaking got your money. <laughs> so, like, yeah, we have no too, need to impress late. you any further. You've <laughs> it's, already it's too late for you. You've already informed us that you've been impressed. <laughs> it's just <laughs> distant hot dog making and server slam discussion. Someone said, I have coworkers in New York City, and they said there's a cart with liquor for sale going around, like adult ice cream truck. Have you guys seen it? Um, I haven't seen it. New York is also, like, so big. It's so big. It's it's big and it's dense. Yeah. It's packed. So, so we haven't seen it. It might, it might not have made it to our part yet. To or maybe, our neck of the woods. Or maybe it drove by outside and we just missed it. Maybe it was right here, and all that's what all the kids were excited about outside. <laughs> they were like, yeah, let's get drunk. Yeah, let's get fucked up for the weekend. It's the, way, it's the freaking weekend. We're New York kids. We can get drunk. New York kids, drunk all the time. <laughs> the that's kind of what they say. Walk. That's kind of <laughs> that's kind of them. This is a really nice pose. This is, this is, this is a big mood yeah. right here. This is that summertime mood. Yeah. He's lounging. I Just mean, that's sitting. this is what I want to be doing. You give me a little, get me a little drink. Maybe he's gonna be holding a little drink. Ooh, Speaking from the which, truck. I have to get up to do a phone call. Does anyone want a drink before I do this? Do this call. Give me some hot dog water. Do you want a hot dog water? <laughs> yeah. Do you want that hot or I'll I'll yeah, give me some, here's the thing. I'll boil some, a hot dog. Some lukewarm hot dog water, please. I'll throw out the hot dog, but I'll give you the water. The water, yeah. Yeah. Great. I would love a seltzer. Yeah, I'll take a seltzer. Okay, cool. A seltzer. A seltzer. Little umbrella. Ooh. Yeah. Probably having like a like a pina colada, but it's made with like rocks or something. Oh yeah. Instead of ice, it's like actual rocks it's in rocks. it. It's rocks. It's on the rocks. It's on the rocks, Nathan. Give me yeah. That, give me that on the rocks, please. You're you're freaking yeah right. I know I am. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, we're seltzing now, baby. Yeah. yeah. Who's ready yeah, to crack it? Like Y'all ready to crack? We're get, we're we're cracking simultaneous. Ready? Oh, no. oh okay. I, here we go. Yep. Three, two, one. Yeah. Oh, baby. I had to get, I had to get the leverage first. Yeah. You have to do the initial, and then you you do the, you do the and then you do the. Yeah, of course. You know. You, anyone who who drinks directly out of the can knows knows what I'm talking about. We got any can drinkers out there? Anybody drinking from the can? Anyone drinking from the can right anyone now? Anyone drinking in the can? Are you on the can? Are you on the can? Drinking from the can? Let us know. Can, can, can you do the can, can? If you can, then I can. Prove it. Damn. Prove it right now, if you can do it. 
I'm looking at you. Yeah. Where's the can can? I didn't say I was going to. I said I could. I can. Well, I don't believe you. You don't have to believe me. <laughs> I don't think this guy can do the can can. I'm gonna be can. honest. I can. I freaking can. I mean, you 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 can say that. Yeah, but... I can. <laughs> You could say it, but I what can. is it? It doesn't mean anything. What Agora? Oh, they got these little like tattoos. Yeah, of this, it up. of this thing. It looks like kind of like a paw print. They all got that. The ones from Ocarina of Time do. Oh yeah, it's like a dinosaur footprint. Yeah, I think it's like their Goron village. Yeah, tat. I'm so excited to get into the new Zelda and oh see like God. what, because in the first one they already did like the Zora Village, yeah, the Goron Village, yeah, the Bird Guy the bird, Village, the Bird People, the and freaking Gerudo, the freaking Kakariko Village. They were like running through all the hits. They, they get, they did it. They were like, remember Ocarina of Time? So do we, and he, we'll prove it to you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here's all the hits. But now they got like floating sky stuff. Yeah, I feel like there's there's gonna be like a lot. They, they can the, do the, the vertical space that you can explore in this game just sort of based on what I've seen it's it seems like a lot it does seem like a lot it seems like there's a lot you can do I'm very excited what if he has like a little mullet yeah absolutely and he's he's sitting like on a rock party in the front and party in the back yeah, he's got like the full Fieri. Yeah. Cause in my mind his hair is blonde, his his goatee is blonde. Yeah. He's sitting on a rock. He's rocking out. This is like how I'm trying to be. Yeah. I think this is this is setting the tone for the stream. A little summertime. A little summertime on the rocks. Summertime Zelda stream. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just Ooh, let's just move this. I like these rock shapes. Thank you. You know, I I, I was going to say I've been practicing, and I have. I've not been practicing rock shapes, but I think that practicing in general yeah. just tends to improve your overall shape language. For sure. Because I've been doing lots of getting someone stylish from Pinterest and then, and then drawing them. Ooh! So I'm doing a lot of like boxy clothing shapes and folds. And, and I think that that's bo similar. Box rhymes with rocks. Box rhymes with rocks and rocks can be box. Anyway, you want to drop? Yeah, can you do me a favor? What's up? Can you erase the part of the rock that's going like right into his elbow? Oh, the tangent part? Yeah, can you just erase that? You don't like the tangent part I of did, the rock? I didn't, I didn't love it. What about this? Thank you. <laughs> that looks better. I was just gonna say, yeah, I think you can just leave it un yeah, I think that's good. I didn't mean to I just No, yeah. you're right. You don't wanna have the tangent. It just kinda it, it looked like a little you know. Died. And I and I and Nathan? listen, when Nathan? I'm drawing, I, I expect you to call out my tangent as well. Yeah. I agree with you. You're right. We don't want tangents on summertime stream. The only tangents we have are in our conversations. Speaking of which, Whoa. let's move on to Nathan. Is me drawing to my drawing? Where should I put this can so I don't fuck everything up? I'll remember it's there. Put the can very far away. I'll move I, my can. I don't want it anywhere near the technology. Ugh. It's even better up close. It's really nice. Mm. Thank you. A Jimmy Buffett style bird boy from Zelda? Oh, that's fun. Okay. Cuz we already have like the one the one that plays the accordion. Yeah, so but imagine if he was playing a guitar playing and... like a uke. Guitar. And had on a Hawaiian shirt. All right, I gotta look up Jimmy Buffett. And he was having a cheeseburger in paradise. Jimmy Buffett. 
James Buffett. And he was the son of a son of a sailor. Yeah, okay. Hawaiian shirt. And guitar. he was in Margaritaville, wasting away. All right, and then Rito. Rito. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They got all sorts. I guess you could do like a sort of a... Like a parrot, sort of a tropical looking. Yeah, like a parrot head. Yeah. That's the Jimmy, the James Buffett fans are parrot heads. That's true. This is true. I guess I should look up what a parrot looks like. They're sort of like a bird. They're sort of like a bird. Imagine, if you will, a bird. Parrot. That's pretty much it. I keep looking up different things. Yeah, there they are. <laughs> is somebody outside pumping the bass? Somebody's outside constantly doing something loud i guess the the bird bard is kind of parrot parrot looking yeah parrot adjacent all right so that, i guess that's just that's just what it's gonna be rebecca roney said youtube mobile is now a cookie clicker like what does that mean what's youtube mobile doing is youtube being weird again are they doing things without telling us it's a cookie clicker like I don't even know what cookie clicker. You don't know cookie clicker? It was like the original, I am seeing the emojis. Were you doing the those emojis? They were like skeeting up. They're skeeting up. Oh, they stopped skeeting as soon as you looked. I think you're. No, dude, they were skeeting I up. I think you're playing. They're a... skeeting up. You saw them. You saw them that time. That's, I don't, I don't like the term you're using well, what else are they doing i think they're they're sort of like flo floating <laughs> no do, dude they're, they're, <laughs> no no dude oh, i gotta draw a freaking guitar guitar is one of the hardest objects to draw it just it looks wrong no matter what i do i also don't it's okay y'all aren't seeing the emojis i'm seeing them they're going crazy now everyone is sending I'm gonna, them i'm just gonna I, I thought I could use your brush and it's ju it's just not doing it. No, that one's for me That one's just for you. We're you gonna did good work with that zero. Yeah, we're gonna time. zero. We're gonna zero in on some Some stuff and we're gonna make we're gonna do it. We're gonna get like sort of a Get like a pose. I Believe in you. We're gonna get a guitar. We're gonna do the guitar out posing People aren't seeing them on desktop, but I'm looking at it but on we, desktop. But we're, but we're on. I'm, but, but I'm in we, the back but end. But the thing is, we're on uh, in the front. Maybe in the back end, you can see them. Let me know when this video goes on the, the VODs, if you see them. If you're like watching back chat, if you see them. They're just between user and creator, but aren't some people seeing them, or is not some people seeing them? Is not some is not some anyone seeing them? I drew this guitar, and I'm gonna cover most of it up with this like gigantic wing hand that these birds have. That's honestly great. I'm gonna say it. You wouldn't be able to play guitar with hands like this. You wouldn't. No one would. You wouldn't. How how are they gonna put? They don't have enough fingies, first of all. To play chords. This is special bird guitar. It's different. Well, it's got like one big string. Yeah. A bird would need like buttons. All right, some people do see them. Maybe they are doing like a staggered rollout of a new feature. They do like to do that. Western Awakening in Nazareteville. People literally play guitar with no hands. Well, yeah, but they're using like other, they have other parts with which to play the guitar. Like feet. Feet. Feet, feet. Feet, feet. Could play slide guitar. This bird could definitely play slide guitar. This bird. This bird. This bird. Right, now let's go back to this 
bird has taken its toll on me. It is a bird. So many times before. Yeah. My bird is birding in front of me. I have to bird. And then I'm gonna bird some more. Oh. Oh. No. No. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, dude. I was so high, I did not recognize a bird standing before my eyes. Yeah! Yeah, they know. They freaking know. The summer boys' energy is off the charts. Yeah, people are honking. We're singing. singing. We're sipping. Really oh, yeah. Just tilting his head back. Crank that head back. Give me back my Ciro. Thank you. I like these wing shapes you got going on. Thanks. Those look nice. Give them a little. Yeah. You know, I saw recently, some of you may be aware that me and Julia, our, our, our favorite streamer we watch is Northern Lion. Got some Northern Lion fans outside. Yeah, they freaking love Live them. reactions. Live react. And I saw this video of this dude. I think he made him as like TikToks and then, and then combined them. But he's like an acapella singer, music producer guy. And he took like all these bits where Northern Lion was singing and then like auto-tuned them and then did acapella like backing to them. And it was so cool. It was so much fun. And I'm like, we got to get someone who's going to do that for us. Yeah. Maybe that guy. Maybe even that guy could be a fan of, of ours. It's entirely possible. Could we get that? I mean, I bet someone that watches us has the skills necessary to make something like that happen. I mean, people have... Jeez Louise. People have done music. They have done similar things to... Yeah, with someone someone did stuff. a pretty good gradient jump scare. Song. Yeah, there were some good ones. <laughs> Deep Blue Ink said I can diversify. Thank you, Deep Blue. Yeah, Link. if you could get right on that, Deep Blue Ink, how's your a cappella singing? Is it good? Oh, the emojis are new for eligible channels and only for iOS. But, but and also but, our screen and also us okay, so it's like I don't want to cut this entire layer I just wanted to undo okay. this is a joyous image it's just you know I bet Jimmy Buffett will buy this you better not sue us for drawing a for drawing parrot. for drawing exactly <laughs> what he looks like if he was a parrot. <laughs> He'd be like, "This is me. You just drew me, but with bird stuff." I mean, I think once this is done, we email it to Jimmy Buffett. We, we email it to his people, and we just say how much. Yeah, and he'll know. They'll know. And he'll be like, "Name whatever price they want. I need it." Yeah. I need to have it. Do we have stats on the Drawfee bump for Cheesy Steve's? Oh. There, there was a significant bump in for, the searchability. In the search, yeah, I don't know how many people have gotten. I saw at least one person was like, we got the episode in right before their, their trip to England, and so they were able to get get some. That's like a, we like fundamentally altered the trajectory of that person's life. Yeah. Cause like, who knows what would have happened if they didn't. If they hadn't, they'd gone to England and then. And they didn't go get and the they cheesy didn't Steve. Get the cheesy Steve. Cause like they had to change their plans, right? Yeah. So it, like whatever they were going to do. Yeah. They, they had didn't to do. They had to go to Dollish. All right. I'm closing this window. It's no, it's summer vibes. No, you can close the window. I'm just going to have. You're just gonna have to close it. I'm just gonna close it a little bit. It's 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 throwing me off my game. It's so loud today. It's 
It's the freaking summer. Summer is out. Summer is here, at least for now. And the people are all about it. What is his, what's his legs? What are, what are the bird's legs doing? They're little. They're they got, like bird legs. They got like little sort of, like these sorts of, sorts of deals. They're just sort of like, these big sort of poof, poofums. They go sort of like poof, and then they got like their feet. Oh, to be a bird person. You get all the all the benefit all the benefits. <laughs> you get all the benefits of being a bird with all the with all the responsibilities of being a person. Yeah, I guess it actually might be better just to be a bird. Cause then you don't have to worry about the person stuff at all. That's true, but then you don't get to enjoy like server slam for example that's true birds there are no birds on on the diablo server slam it's also like birds if you're a bird you don't get to be like damn it sure is sick to be a bird right you just it's just your life you just are a bird yeah. and you don't really you don't think about it but, but if, if you're, you're a bird person if you're a bird person you're like oh wow i get to be a bird and a person like, I get the awareness of how cool it is to be a bird. If you could be... Yeah. A redneck. Huh? Not a redneck. If you could be... If you could be... If you could be you, a redneck... You might... If you could be a redneck, you might. Would you? If, if, you, if you could be a redneck, <laughs> would, would, would you? Would you? Would you? The worst combination of assets. <laughs> Mero Beba would. <laughs> if you could be any of the Zelda races, mm -hmm. which one would you choose? Bird. Bird you, guy. you would be bird? Flying is OP. Flying is kind of OP. Also, like, the flying dude is, like, really pretty sick with it. Yeah. I'm thinking maybe of um, the one from Hyrule Warriors mm. 2 or whatever. The Calamity of Ganon or whatever it was called. The bird dude in that one was, like, crazy. He's different from the bird dude in... Breath of the Wild. Well, in the in the Hyrule Warriors two, mm -hmm. Calamity of Ganon, mm -hmm. you, you there's like time travel shenanigans, mm -hmm. and so the the ancient heroes, the ones that were like in the past, mm -hmm. they come into the present and join your squad. So you get the bird person you meet in Breath of the Wild, and also the original bird person uh... hero from a thousand years before. Uh, and he's different and he's even and he that's the one you're talking yeah about. he's built different for sure yeah they, they know outside they know about him yeah i feel like we're gonna have to put this guy on the same canvas as the goron when you're done so like he's playing and the goron is sitting and having yeah. his drink i think that's gonna make people feel pretty good to see I hope I hope it, it looks good next to that Goron because that Goron was very good. This is this is all right. I'm still I'm still not the best at Clip Studio using, but I think you're doing great. We're having fun. We're just trying stuff, you know. I like I like what it does to your art to do it. I feel like it gives it a, a flavor. A little spice, a little spicy flavor. I guess we could have used Photoshop today too. No, but Stream, streams is for streams is for Clip Studio. For clipping, we're clipping. Clip that. I didn't answer which Zelda race I would be, but I, it's like it would probably be. I would probably be a Gerudo if I got to be a giant woman. Which is statistically incredibly likely. Yeah. If I'm a Gerudo. Yeah. Because it's like 1.1% as like a dude. Right. Occasionally. And, and, like, and, and if you're the dude, you have to be Ganon. You pretty much have to be Ganon because he's like the only one. Okay, wait, wait. I have a... 
what if what if i could be a gerudo but i'm just like a little guy <laughs> so you're like the one dude i'm just the one who's dude been born but, but you're just a little but guy i'm just like a little guy and they the ladies all think and you're like really whoa cute. hey <laughs> <laughs> yeah i do that's that's sort of my vibe i'm the guy i'm the i'm the little guy hey, i'm just <laughs> a little guy i'm just a little guy hey pick me up <laughs> i'm the only one in a thousand years but yeah but, <laughs> but but the ladies they the gerudo ladies like they freaking love that shit yeah they're like all about it they're like this little guy is great he's the mascot if i if if I would switch. I would switch from bird to if you could be a little if, guy. Yeah, it's it's more. It's like in general, bird I think is better. But if if I could control the odds and be just a little guy, that all the that all the uh, the Gerudo ladies absolutely absolutely love. Yeah, that and, would be pretty sick. Yeah. I feel like being a Goron affords you the least benefits. But you, you just like to... live on a hot mountain. Yeah, that's kind of, and you can roll. Redoing these legs, by you the can way. roll around. They were fine, but I'm redoing them. Okay, because I want I want him to be doing the like the Jimmy Buffett like one step, like he's doing like a step, like he's sort of like. This might be a mistake. To attempt but I want to try it and then I think being a Zora gives you more benefits than Goron but less benefits than Rito because you can go under the water right the water and there's is... a lot under there yeah now he looks like he's about to fall <laughs> <laughs> oh I'm slipping okay. you can give him a rotate give him a zotate okay, okay. we're gonna we're gonna make this work I feel like gonna... if the bird person was not an op. Oh my god. Dude. Sorry, sorry. Zora lovers outside. Zora lovers have assembled outside our house. Let's do them like this. Then this leg come forward, this leg go back. Because Zora can go under the water, so they have that extra, like, traveling ability. Mm -hmm. But I can travel. If I can fly, I can go over the yeah, water. Yeah, you don't even need to worry about that. And over the land also. So I feel like that's just even more. It's just even yeah, better. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. It's like the bird, the bird stuff is like in general better, but there's something really appealing to me about just being one little guy that all the big ladies love. Yeah, I could see where there would be appeal to that for sure. But what about the Koroks? Mm, they are plants. They are little guys. And they are little guys, and they do get to hide around and go, aha! But that's like kind of their whole, that's like all they do. But what about the big one with the maracas? I mean, I like to look at him. I, I feel like it's a lot of responsibility to be him, though, you know? Like, you're the big one with the maracas. Like, that's like, it's like a lot of responsibility. Yeah, everyone's got some expectations of you. Like you gotta be like, what if you're just not feeling it that day? Like no one's gonna, no one's gonna like it if they they see the big Korok <laughs> with the maracas and he's just kind of like, no, I'm not really feeling it today. I need a day off today. <laughs> kind of. Can I just? I'm just not really feeling the maracas today. I don't know. It's not like a maraca. It's just the vibe. The vibe is not maracas for me today. And they're like, come on, do a little dance with the maracas. We love it. We love to see you. And it's like at the same time, you know that like for them, that might be the only chance they get to see you. Right. It's, and so you're like, you feel the pressure to like. Right. You want to, you don't want, because then they're going to be like, I saw the guy, the Korok with the maracas, and he was such a bummer. And then like they write about it. And then. You're like, I was so disappointed like, don't when believe I met the, the Korok hype. with the maracas. Yeah. You don't want to, you don't want to create that situation. No. Meanwhile, the Korok from the maracas with the maracas has to be the Korok with the maracas every day. Every day. Yeah. And so I you know. yeah, I would rather just see the Korok with maracas than than have to that that's too much responsibility for me. I totally uh, you know, I totally agree with you now. It does seem like fun from from the outside, but it, I think it's 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 more fun to see than it is to be. That's my take. Seeing is being. Well, that's what they say.
seeing some compliments about your leg changing and they, i agree they, they like it i think you making it a good steppy has has put a lot more movement into the image thank you now he's strutting his stuff he's strutting all right now let's get your your boy back he's so faint <laughs> yeah my boy's a little faint let's we, we do, can let's, we let's can do, duplicate the dupe, layer let's dupe the layer that's um you probably just right click i think i think and, i'm probably just gonna do it that and duplicate way it. i don't i don't trust so these are the originals and now we can we can we can arrange them in a in a aesthetically pleasing fashion. Well they actually kinda yeah. It's pretty good. Just gotta lighten mine up a little so it matches. Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. That's bringing some vibes. That's, some, that's freaking summertime, baby. Let's I'm go. I'm feeling some vibes now. I'll use the felt pen just to like get us a little like Oh, it's the sun. Yeah. It's right, right next to his head. Well, it's it's in the sky. I mean, it looks like it's right next to his head. I that's sort of the the thing about the sun is it like. It um, looks... Nathan, I can literally see it, and it's right there. <laughs> you can't tell me that it's not shut when I'm up. seeing it. What do you mean? Shut, shut up, shut, dude! Shut up! Dude. Don't tell me to shut up, <laughs> dude! Freaking! I can see it. Close your mouth. I'm just kidding. We're just joking around. You're telling me. We're just joking around. It's a joke. I'm not joking. It's jokes time. I'm not joking. It's jokes o'clock. You want me to draw again? Yes. <laughs> I don't know if Julia's ever coming back. Yeah, what's she? Am I allowed to ask what she's on the phone about? Is that, is it, it's a secret. It's a secret. Okay. It's a secret. It's it's like she's she's finding out about the server slam. She's <laughs> yeah, getting, she's calling. She's getting the deets on the server slam. She's calling Diablo. I'm calling Diablo. I'm done. Oh, Julia's back. I'm You're sorry. back. I literally just said you might not come back, but then you came back. I'm sorry. I'm back. As if to prove Jacob wrong. Yeah. It was you actually. Couldn't have waited like a couple minutes after I said that. <laughs> yeah. So the people forgot. Well, it's your turn to draw. If you're oh, okay. Turn. Yeah. Are you, are you ready to? Do you, do do I ready? Yeah. Do you like this? Do you like this summary scene <laughs> that we've got? Yeah, I love it. We're hoping that this is what the new Zelda is about. Yeah, it's one chill sort of Guy Fieri inspired Goron and one yeah. chill Jimmy Buffett inspired Rito and they just sort of hang out and vibe. I mean, the Goron kind of looks a little like, whoa. Yeah. Well, he's whoa. been he's been drinking. He's been drinking. I'll tell oh, you okay. that for free. So he's he's vibing. He's been drinking. Okay. He's been drinking. What am I drawing? I literally don't remember what the Koroks look like, other than they have little leaves in front of their faces. That's like 80% of their body. They're little guys with leaves <laughs> in front of their faces, but one of them's big and has maracas. And as we discussed... Um, Isn't it like... Also, Julia, which of the which of the Zelda races would you be? Yeah, we were just having this discussion. We were having this discussion. Um... Oh, that's a good question. Nathan said Rito. Rito in general, but if I get to if I get to choose more specific, I'd want to be the one the one rare Gerudo dude, but mm -hmm. instead of a Ganondorf, I just want to be like a, a little guy. <laughs> I mean all of the guys that are involved with the Gerudos that aren't Ganondorf are just little guys. Yeah. For the most part. So that's that's what I'm that's what I'm about. Okay. And I want to be a Gerudo if I get to be a giant woman. Okay. If I don't get to be a giant woman, then I'll be a Rito as yeah. well. Because flight is... Um, Flight's pretty pretty sick. Flight's pretty... It's a tough one to... To pass to up. To pass up, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Maybe he'll have like... You got a little maracas? Yeah. Oh, you'll grow into a big maraca guy someday. Yeah, if you keep practicing. I know you will. Yeah. And he's going to love it. He's not going to Yeah. He's not going to let the pressure of being the big maraca guy get to him. What would I be? A Lizalfos. Mm. You would not be a Don't lie. <laughs> I don't know. Azora? You want to go in the water? You wet? 
You want to be wet? You want to be a little fish? <laughs> I mean... I do like the Zoras that have the, the like the manta ray head instead of the fish head. Oh, yeah. Who do I we got left? I want to be Goron, King Zora. Zora. And go... I'm definitely not a Goron. I mean, you could also be a Gerudo if you want. See, but I'm not someone who likes the sun. That's fair. But you might if you were a Gerudo. Yeah. They have much darker skin than you, so they can withstand the sun's rays. You could also just be like a like a, a Hylian or a I could, or a Sheikah. Yeah. We didn't uh, even we didn't even talk about the Sheikah are pretty sick. I would probably be a Sheikah because they're like a ninja. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Be an Orok? Aren't those the little water birdos? And I like when you play as Octorok? as Impa in Hyrule Warriors. She has a big sword, and I respect that. What is is she? Is she a Shika? Impa is a Shika. Yeah, she's like yeah. the Shika. Yeah, I think I, I would I be never a Shika. Played, I never played Hyrule Warriors. I just remember that one guy playing it on the plane, and then he interviewed us. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show right. you Impa. Impa's pretty sick. What am I drawing? I mean, I like this guy a lot. <laughs> this is it, and I'm done. I left the stream for like half an hour. I came back, drew something that took me ten seconds. Well, you also drew the leaf guy with the maracas. So let's not. You calling someone? No, it did sound like a phone ringing, but I don't think. I think most sounds we're hearing are coming from outside. Yeah. Someone said that I should draw the the Finnish dude from Eurovision. Let oh, me tell you. Yeah. This is the Impa. I'm, I'm not talking about the other Impa. I'm talking about this Impa. Yeah, the Impa rules. Not the one that's like kawaii freaking whatever mm -hmm. from Age mm -hmm. of Calamity. I want the one who's got the thing over the eye and the big sword. Yeah, the one who looks like she's having none of it. Um, Yeah, the Finnish dude from Eurovision. Let me tell you. Been sharing that with everyone I know. I have not. I'm ahead of you. I do, I the never. Cha cha cha. Yeah. Are I, you ready for the? I never know about Eurovision. You ready for the dude from? I do not have Eurovision. Finland? I have American Vision only. Nathan, you need to expand your vision to not be so American centric. This is what the dude from. Ooh. That's really good. I like this. I like this a lot. And then he's got like big pecs. Okay, so that's just the, t and then it's just out. The pecs yeah, are just, just out. That's awesome. And then he's that got rules. Spikies. Oh hell yeah! He looks like he looks like he'd be one of the characters in the Running Man, based on the way you've drawn him. I mean, that's kind of what he looks is like. That, is that a helmet or his hair? He's got like a monk bowl cut. Oh, amazing. Wait, so it's bald on top? It's not bald on top. No, it's not top. bald on okay. top. So it's not a monk bowl cut. It's just a, it's it's a mob, mob psycho. Yeah, it's a mob psycho. When you started drawing him, it looked like mob psycho. But He's got now, like... Now it, I mean, this could be a character in mob psycho. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. I mean, like platform boots. Or a character in One Punch Man. <laughs> the platforms are different sizes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyway. That's awesome. Wait, no, keep it. Okay. Keep it. Don't delete keep it. Keep it. We need it. <laughs> keep it. We it's need good. it for later. It's good. Keep it. Oh. I'm finished. Well, thank I'm you. so excited. I hope he wins. He You're finished, but we're just getting started. Yay! Whoa! We're actually like halfway through. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but imagine if but like it was but like imagine if you could have said you're finished but we're halfway we're just well, we're halfway ju julia's through. just getting started that's true julia Ju is just getting that's started. true yeah we've just been 
we've just been freaking bullshitting over here waiting for julia to come back and now, now we can really now we can really get into it now we can really talk about the server slam <laughs> 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 we can talk deets vampire beach slam vibes deets. are you saying that about this guy or that should i should draw that because i'll draw that what it was the problem? vampire beach vibes Ooh. i'll draw that draw you draw a vampire beach yeah i mean a beach vampire on vampire beach beach full of vampires vampires Typically don't Typically, like to go out in the sun. Right. I mean, you could do night beach. Though. Could be night beach. Could be I, night beach. Or it could make it have a really big umbrella. I'll tell you something. <laughs> yeah. Big fan of night beach. Yeah. Night beach, that's, if, that's where you go if you want to really feel some stuff. Yeah. If you go out on night beach and you stare into the sea and the stars in the sky... You will have an existential crisis, but in yeah. a positive way. A positive way. Yeah. But also, you can do night beach uh, if you get some some glow sticks. Sure. Get some glow sticks, tie a string to the glow sticks, and just just chuck them. Just chuck them. Just chuck them as as hot. You do a big. You do sort of a big wind up. You go. Whoa, 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 whoa. And they go away. And up. they just go, and you just. And it's like you're not going to hit anyone because it's a beach. Because it's night beach. It's night beach. No one is no there. No one's there except you and, and your glow sticks. Or you could be. It's like you're at the you're at the hotel, right? And the hotel is like on the beach, connected to the beach, and so someone's having a wedding at the hotel. Uh huh. And so in the in sort of like the outdoor sort of courtyard area of the hotel. It's just the jams are, are bumping. Right. And so you, you can hear them from the beach. And so you just go down. You go down there. You're not in, in the wedding. You just walk past everyone. Everyone's vibing. Everyone's dressed real good. You're just in your, like, regular hotel clothes. And you go to the beach, and you can hear the jams bumping in the distance. You can, you can feel the energy of the party. Yeah. And you just, you just dance. You just dance on night beach. You just beach. dance on night beach. And it's like you're not in the party, but you're still part of it. You're feeding off the energy. Yeah. That's beautiful. Yeah. I do want to circle back on what hotel clothes are. Because mm -hmm. you said you were in your ho normal hotel clothes. Yeah. Yeah. So what I'm is... not sure exactly what. Sort of like. Are a... your hotel clothes different than it's like non hotel the, is clothes? Is it the robe that they give you no. at the hotel? <laughs> no, it's. Sorry. It's. Okay. Um, Cause like you're not dressed, you're not dressed to go to the like people at the wedding. They're they're dressed like, you know, button downs. They're wedding clothes. In wedding clothes, you're mm -hmm. just wearing like maybe, maybe like a light sort of floral print, short sleeve button down. Yeah. And some shorts, and some flippy flops. That you got from the hotel. That you got, well you you brought you brought them to the hotel. Oh. But that's what you wear. That's what you wear around the hotel. What about like a... I mean, you can wear whatever you want. That's just what my hotel... Anyone, anything can be hotel clothes if you wear them at the hotel. How do we feel about a linen pant? Ooh. I like a very, linen pant. Very breathable. Yeah. I've been thinking about a linen pant for the summer. Yeah. What do we think about that, Chad? L long or short? <laughs> Well, sort of, pro probably like a crop, like mm -hmm. a cropped pant, like yeah. a long pant. That but it you get, get with a bit of a crop, ankle, yeah, ankles a bit of an out. ankle crop, like a like a, a loose capri pant. Yeah, not not so short as to be considered a capri, but I do love a like love a crop, a crop. What kind of underwear does one wear with linen pants? No underwear. No underwear. Linen wear. It's linen. You just you just let the linen caress your yeah, stuff. You let the linen caress your stuff. <laughs> <laughs> that's what they tell you in the store. Yeah, that's the, that's the slogan for the linen pant company. Let the linen caress <laughs> your stuff. <laughs> let the linen caress your stuff. 
<laughs> you can wear whatever you want <laughs> under there. Yeah, I think it's fine. You it's probably fine. don't want to wear like dark underwear. I would imagine. Can I can I tell you my my uh, pant anecdote? Please? Yeah, I love a pant anecdote. Pant anecdote. So, so last weekend it was also really sort of summery here, mm -hmm. here in the city, and yeah, we yeah yeah it was summery. We were here. We, that, that's what I'm telling them. That's why I'm telling them. Uh, and but I it was it was like the first. The first of its its name, the first of its kind. Mm -hmm. um, so I was expecting, and I looked I looked at the temps, and it to me read it was it was still sixties. It was like high sixties, but it was sixties, and so to me that was like okay, I should still wear like jeans, mm -hmm. but I I won't wear. I'll just do jeans and a t shirt sort of sort of vibe. So I went out. I was out. I was out on the town with Emily. And it was it was hotter to be walking than than was comfortable to be in jeans. Yeah, that'll happen. And and me just sort of like my in my mind, like that would have just been it. I would have just been like, well, did, I made a mistake, and I'm trapped. I'm trapped in these jeans mm -hmm. as long as I'm out, and I'm and I'm uncomfortable and 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 angry at myself for having done this. And so I articulated this to Emily, and she was like, well, "Let's just go get you some shorts." That's the move. And it like it truly would never have crossed my mind <laughs> to to do that. And like we did, and it was it was instantly better. It was like it it made the day so much more pleasant. Yeah, <laughs> like that's amazing. It was. And and I really like the shorts I got, you know. That's even better. I'm I'm not wearing them right now, but I probably will at some point over the summer because they're good. And I don't even they they might be linen. I didn't I didn't check the material. Well, I how just, do they caress your stuff? They in a linen way. <laughs> well, I was I was my stuff w was was already being caressed by underwear. I didn't I didn't go no. I haven't uh, allowed the these newly purchased shorts to caress my stuff on their own. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh huh. Um, but they they felt nice, and they really just it just made the rest of the day so much nicer. <laughs> it's just like, wow, you can do that. I, you I actually think of doing that all the time. Like I've done that many times that's, in my life. Well, that's you. That's a difference between you and me. It is. is you're. That's like absolutely something I could see you doing. Just like walk into a store and like, yeah, these. But I, I, I don't know. Usually buying clothes, I have like a mental block around where I'm like, this is a chore and I hate this. Yeah. But it was so easy. It was literally like the first pair of shorts that I saw that I, I kind of liked the, the look and feel of. Yeah. And I just tried them on and then was like, can I wear these out of the store? And they were like, yeah. You can <laughs> just pay for them. You can. It's easy. And then we also at that store bought a little backpack that I put my my jeans in. Wow. And so I got a little backpack and some shorts and a, and a nice afternoon out of the deal. And That's I just a delightful story. I just thought yeah. it was a nice. It, you reminded me of it with the linen pants talk. The first time I ever came to New York when I was twenty one years old, uh -huh. I made the same mistake. I only brought pants. Yeah, and it was an unseasonably hot weekend. And it it just it just keeps getting hotter. All the bodies, all yeah. the bodies generating heat. All the all the the concrete surfaces bouncing the heat back at you. Yeah, but I, unlike you, day one, you just did. I was like, you didn't need to I'm be just prompted gonna, by your partner. I'm to... just gonna go get some shorts because I'm too hot. Well, that's and there's stores everywhere because we're in manhattan as a 21 year old i can't imagine having that confidence as a 20 well it wasn't confidence i just didn't want to be hot well that that wherewithal the, the, <laughs> i don't like I, to I, suffer there, there i don't either but i don't think of solutions <laughs> yeah i was about to say here's the key difference between you two jacob so doesn't want to be inconvenienced that 
he will find a solution so that he's no longer inconvenienced. Yeah, I just Nathan don't. Nathan just accepts his fate. I don't entertain the possibility that solutions <laughs> exist. You're just like, I've made a mistake and now I must suffer yeah, the consequences. Uh, that's just, this is just what my life is right now and forever. And it's really nice having people in my life to remind me that, in fact, no, <laughs> there, there are many things you can do as a person <laughs> to make <laughs> your experience better. Um, which this also reminds me that a thing that I've really had to convince Jacob of is that uh, it doesn't matter what it says the temperature is outside. Right. It doesn't matter. You got to look at the feels like. Because New York's got so much, feels like. it has it's got so much humidity. Mm -hmm. It's got so many factors. You gotta look at the, you gotta look what at the, the feels, feels like. like. I mean, you didn't really have to convince me of it. It's more that you just told me about it. I really had to convince you. <laughs> and now I look at the feels like. But sometimes I'm like, "What is it outside?" And you give me the temperature, and I go, "But what's the feels like?" And you go, "Hmm." Well, usually I give you the temperature if I feel like it's in a range in which the feels like couldn't possibly drastically impact your decision making. I've drawn Oron. I've drawn Beach Oron. This is Beach Oron. Oron? And he from Final Fantasy X. Yeah. You telling me we've drawn a Goron and an Oron on this Get stream? Get out of here. This hey. is this is ridiculous. Me, is that what you're telling me? I'm gonna get closer. Okay. I don't know why I was so far away. Well, normally there's um, there's another another, per chair. another person there. Yeah. It's nice to be this close. You can see stuff. Yeah. Like the chat. You can see chat. What's up, chat? Did you like um? Did you like my shorts anecdote? I didn't. I I couldn't see. They the, liked it. Yeah. The they, most people well. agreed with you that they also would not have thought to do it. <laughs> So you are not alone. That's awesome. In that feeling, I'm glad I can be relatable to you, Chad. I love doing it so much that we were at Julia's parents' place one time for her mom's birthday, and it was a little colder than expected. Oh. And Julia was like, "Well, there's a mall like right nearby." Ooh. And I was like, "Oh, let's go to the mall, and I'll get some sort of overshirt nice. scenario." And then Julia's parents were like, "You can just like borrow. We have like a bunch of sweatshirts and hoodies and stuff. You can borrow one." And I was like, "No." <laughs> I want to go. I want to go. I want to. I leave. want to go and get, I want to go to the mall. I want to go to the mall and get a, an overshirt. And I'm glad I did. Yeah. Because I came out with that that orange shacket that I have that I really like. Ooh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And people, also a, people love a, how that looks on you. A blue button down overshirt. I'm and I like both people. of them a lot. Hell yeah. So it, it worked out in the end. I do like to borrow uh, an article of clothing. If someone offers, I will I will probably accept the, the borrow situation. That would have been the more reasonable thing to do, but you undoubtedly. Got, you got some cool, again, that's that confidence. Well, it was an excuse also. I haven't been to like a mall. Like yeah. I never make it to a mall. That's true. And so it was kind of fun to just go to a mall. And smell those mall smells. Those mall smells. It's a lot of the food court. Annie yeah. Ann's. Yeah. All malls court, smell the same. Candles. Too many candles. I like the shading, Julia. Thank you. It's the second time I've heard the word shacket in my life, and both times it's been Jacob. <laughs> you need to know about these things. You need to know about these things. So you know what you get. It's a shirt jacket. The ambulance yeah. is here to <laughs> take away everyone who didn't know about shackets. Yeah. They were stunned. Yeah. By the shacket. Now when you go to the store next, you can look and you can see if there's a shacket that appeals to you. Find a shacket near you. I've yeah. seen a few people in chat espousing the virtue of wearing a hoodie with shorts. Oh, yeah. And I... Literally have never done that in my life. Whoa. Because it seems honestly a little crazy to me. I because like, if I need a hoodie, then I should be wearing pants. I like hoodie with shorts. And if I'm wearing shorts, I probably don't need a hoodie because it's warm enough to wear shorts. But sometimes 
I, again, I think I think Night Beach is a perfect example of a time. Okay, Night when, Beach when hoodie and shorts. You got me there. Night is, Beach is good because you don't you don't want to necessarily get sand on your pants. You want to you want like the freedom. You want like shorts, the sort of shorts flip flops combo, so you can go barefoot on the beach, feel that the cool sand on your toes. But then you you need to counterbalance that with a little hoodie. I think night beach is the only time I could see. That does make sense to me. Night beach is a great time for hoodie with shorts. Where's my phone? Can I have my phone? Boop. I remember I went and saw Judah Friedlander do stand up at, at my college and one of my friends was wearing a hoodie with shorts and Judah Friedlander freaking ripped him to shreds. Oh no. Not really. I mean, J Judah He's, Friedlander. Your friend died. He was just like, you're wearing a hoodie with shorts. Why not just wear pants? But, you know, sort of a more Judah Friedlander-y. I mean, that's... I I don't... Oh, the Count is there. I like that the Count is here. I like that the Count is on is on the beach. I don't have any problem with other people doing it. I want to be clear about that. I think you should wear whatever you like and whatever makes you feel good. Oh my God, I have news. The Diablo 4 server slam is now live and open to all. I just got that email. In the stream. Is it only open, do Do I need to leave to get, to get on the slam? No, no, you can slam. Can I slam tomorrow? You can slam tomorrow. Okay. We're all gonna slam tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, Let let's me all know. slam tomorrow. Let me know about that off stream. No, I think we should plan it now. Okay. What time? <laughs> what time tomorrow? 8 a.m. <laughs> That's when Nathan's going to bed. <laughs> Me awake at 8 a.m. Hello, Olive. Hello. Olive, Jacob and I were discussing this today. Um, we don't know what's happened to her. She's... She's so cuddly. She wants more affection that is than is possible to give her. We were petting her for like an hour this morning, and then we got up to walk to another room, and she sprinted after us, oh. jumped on the bed, and screamed at us. Wow. <laughs> she does that like all day. She just follows me and screams at me wherever I go. Wow. I think we need to get like a machine that like pets her on all sides simultaneously. Yeah, what and if we, we just, do a like, multi hand pet? We just put her in there and leave her in there for like an hour. <laughs> Jacob, you and I were just at the beach. I just saw it last weekend. You, you oh, went to the we, beach. We were at Coney Island. Yeah, yeah. which well, that's is got the, a beach. that is the beach, but not a beach in in the way Jacob thinks about the beach, as we've established. Yeah. No, it's it's different. I still like it though. Coney Island was great. I was. Is that I, video out yet? I don't. Do we talk about that on a stream or a video? I don't, I don't remember. I think it was on a stream. It okay. was on a stream because okay. I remember reading chat. Okay. Okay. Good. 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 Because <laughs> get this: some people agreed with me, and some didn't agree Did with me. Did not that. agree with you? Yeah. In chat. In chat. There was a difference of opinions in yeah. chat. People felt different ways about it. Wow. But. Coney I, Island's fun. I loved Coney Island. Yeah, Coney Island's mm -hmm. great. I thought it was great. They got the Big Nathans there. We ate at the Big Nathans. Yeah, yeah. we ate at a Big Nathans. We ate at the Big Nathans. That's the Big Nathans. That's the Big Nathans? Yeah. Because there was, there was Nathans's everywhere. Yeah, well, that's the Big Nathans. But and then the there's one on one. the boardwalk. The big one, though. Yeah. Yeah, we ate at the big one. We ate at the Big Nathans. The one that has the two lines, and then we went on the wrong yeah. line, and we still got a hot dog. Yeah. yeah. In yeah, the non-hot dog It's section. confusing in there. It's purposefully very confusing in there. Yeah. It's too big. Yeah. And then they like hid the straws and they hid the condiments that's and you great. had to like find love, everything. That's, that's freaking Coney Island, baby. At the Big Nathan's. At the Big Nathan's. Get lost at the Big Nathan's. Get confused and overwhelmed at the Big Nathan's, they say. Coney Island's one of my favorite places in general. I've only been... I think once, but... Oh, you're drawing Coney Island. Yeah, why not? Because there's the big parachute thing. Big parachute drop, and then, like, the baseball stadiums here. Nathan, we should go to a Cyclones game. Okay. Together. It was fun. We went with Julia's friends, and I none of us care about baseball at yeah. all, mm -hmm. but it was still a good that's, time. That's what minor league baseball games are for. Yeah, we exactly. We ate hot dogs and ice cream. 
and drank beers. And uh, I convinced my friend who is scared of roller coasters to go on the cyclone. Yeah, we that's, we talked about that. Yeah, because I told him that it wasn't that scary, and then he screamed that I lied. It's very funny. It's a funny story and a funny picture. It was a good time. Uh, I'm done. Hell My favorite yeah. thing about this drawing is this little count. I like everything about it. Look at him. Yeah. But I do like the count the best. Yeah. Because he looks like... He's giving the vibe that he's been talking nonstop all day, and well, the he, other vampire is just like trying to ignore him at this point. Well, he just, there's so many things to count on the beach. That's true. Grains One of sand. One seagull. <laughs> two seagulls. Ah, ah, ah. Three Nathans. Three. <laughs> One Nathan's famous hot dog. Two Nathan's famous <laughs> hot dog. Ah. Uh, oh wait, uh, that was the same seagull. Oh, let me start I over. I have to start over. Ah, ah, ah. The cyclone is good, bad. <laughs> it's just, yeah, that it's just good. The, the facial expression was like it's it's on its own in a vacuum. It's pretty chill, but <laughs> with that added context, it's just like <laughs> right on the edge of being like <laughs> vampire angry, holding it together. When the two vampires get mad at each other. Here's the thing about the cyclone. It's really good, but you will feel like you got beat up. Which That's is kind fun. of a Coney Island experience, yeah. really. The cyclone also, if you were like if you wanted to get a headache, yeah. The cyclone's a great way to do it. It just yeah. it just rattles your brain it just around gives inside you your a headache. Skull, yeah. Guaranteed. Because it's also it's so fast. It's so fast. It's it just too around. it's too rattly. It was fun though. How long the line to get on the cyclone? None. None, None line. None, None line. line. No I one think wants we to went ride. on the off season. Okay. Yeah, everything was like summer yet. non lines. Because yeah, when I went to Coney Island, there was lines for everything, so I did not do any oh, rides. Oh, you gotta go on the off season. It's okay. Well, I, did, I, I, you gotta tell you, me these let's, things. You gotta let's tell us. Let's slam at Coney Island. <laughs> slam Coney Island servers. Yeah. Yeah. Who's this? Is that beak or ears? It's ears. It's ears. Now I'm gonna get a drink. I'll definitely not spend half an hour again in okay. a different room. Who's this? I don't know. This is. Sorry, I'm a girl. <laughs> this is. This is the story of a girl. The world is a vampire. Please, please draw the big Nathan. <laughs> right, it's the big Nathans. <laughs> Belong each Nathan's famous belongs to a different size. A, a different Nathan. A big, yeah. yeah, and the size of the, the store reflects the size of the, the Nathan. Dumpling frogs. Dumpling frogs. That's a that's a cute idea. Dumpling oh. frogs. Holy. They are dumplings and frogs. Dumpling frogs. Dumplings. Because I want to do like different types. Different types. Different types. You got soup. You got gyoza. Why are dumplings so freaking good? You've got the sort of southern style, which is, is just like a bread ball basically sweep i think honestly yeah basically every culture has in some fashion come up with a dumpling yeah. variant for put, good reason put the meat inside the dough and you cook it and it's good um and i think that they're generally some of the best things they're just little morsels that any of any cuisine you find like whatever the dumpling variation is yeah for that cuisine you it's hard to go wrong it's, it's just a little, little pocket of food a little parcel a little parcel it's, it's all it's all parcel. contained Ooh, those are the this is like a soupy that's one. the soup the soup dumplings we get from the place we order from is yeah. a tortellini a dumpling yes yes that's a cheese dumpling is a tortellini a dumpling yeah Yes. Kind of. It is. Is a calzone a dumpling? Yes. No. Too big. Too big. I don't. I'm not convinced a tortellini is a dumpling. How is it not a dumpling? 
because of the way it's like what about served. a ravioli it's a little it's a little parcel what about a ravioli yes it is I ravioli I, yes i haven't really thought what about, about this. a tortelloni yes is a dumpling a sandwich no mm. Well, based on, it depends on yeah, according to <laughs> which rule set we're talking about here. All right. What about the Randy rules? The ra According to the Randy rules, it is a sandwich. It is right? a sandwich. Wow. We get to see Randy and talk to him about his rules and see if he, if he even remembers. I'm sure he if remembers. He, if he realizes how iconic his rules are to us. How much his rules have... His rules saved us. Yeah. Frog. Frog. Jacob also realized that his sweatshirt, not this one, but the sweatshirt he wears all the time, is actually Randy's sweatshirt. Well, well I, I didn't. I didn't realize it. I, it's more that I. You remembered. I remembered that I probably had not shared that information with you. Yeah. But it was because I had a hoodie. Uh, well, a zip-up hoodie. Mm -hmm. that was like all black including the the tassels and the zipper spot but i wanted one that had white tassels and a white zipper spot and then randy came in wearing that hoodie with the white and i made a comment like oh i you know i wanted to get a hoodie like that one and he was like i wanted one that was all black and we were like should we just trade hoodies so you did a trade so we did a hoodie trade at the office and i still wear that hoodie to this day that's great that's like that's just the kind of guy Randy is. He'll just he'll just match your vibe and make your day. Yeah, Randy is an excellent vibe matcher. Randy and I got hired at the same time. We were at the same orientation. We were hire buds. This is same good. day buddies. This is this is a good drawing. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> this is good. Another incredible just mood. <laughs> just <like>. <laughs> 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 yeah. All right. I feel like we need to get one of the. That it's got like a hippo mouth. It works. It's working for me. I gotta decide on the orientation. I feel like the mouth actually needs to be like a little bit more this way. I kind of like the the lopsidedness, but I I like this version as well. Well, it's like the mouth is not that um, we're going for like anatomical correctness with no. this, but the mouth is supposed to line up with the eyes. I know the corners of the mouth. I'm saying it for chat. If you ever are wondering why you're... Yeah, but I know. I want well, chat. Yeah, but... I'm also saying this for chat. Chat, I know what Jacob's talking about. Chat, Nathan already knows this. <laughs> so don't think that I'm like trying to explain it to Nathan because Nathan knows. Yeah, chat, I want you to know that I know thing. But the corners of the mouth line up with the center of the eye. So that's a good way to ratio your shit if your stuff's looking all fucked. It's a good way to L plus ratio. It's a good your... way to L plus ratio your shit. That car agrees. Okay, what about... What about one of these fellers? Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. They're like this. We got to get sort of the Ooh, shape in here. Oh, yeah. And then they're they're cronkled. Cronkled. Mm -hmm. <laughs> cronkled. Like this. Ooh, that looks so tasty. Jacob, yeah. you making me hungry. I'm making you want some hot dog water? I'm making <laughs> yeah. You'd have to make the hot dog in order to get the hot dog water. Yeah, that's what I told Nathan before. I was that I'm gonna I was gonna boil a hot dog and then throw the hot dog out and give him the hot dog water. <laughs> Soup dumpling, but it's just filled with hot chopped, dog water. chopped up hot dog <laughs> in hot dog water. <laughs> Oh. It looks just like a delicious soup dumpling, but when you bite into it, it's hot dog water. Yeah. What a what a vile crime. Yeah. To commit. Is a scotch egg a dumpling? No. 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 It's an egg. That's it's also that's breaded and fried. Yeah. Which is dumplings are not breaded. That's a nugget. That's an egg nugget. 
Dumplings are not breaded. No. Don't. Why it's would a, you even say that? It's a. It's a wrapper. It's a, a delicious sort of soft dough that's still very tender. Tender and savory. Look <laughs> at these little guys. What do they eat? Flies. They're full of flies. They're still frogs. Yeah, they're frogs. After all. They just look real tasty. But they're they're full of they're full of flies. Are those prepackaged PB and J things a dumpling? No, that's bread. That's bread. That's bread. It's gotta be dough, not bread. It's not bread. It's dough. It's dough. It's dough. It's dough, dude. It's dough, dude. dude. I got I got speaking of bread versus dough, I got mad at MasterChef the other day because they had a dude on and he was like, Your challenge is to make bread the hero of your dish. And everyone was like, whoa. And he's like, let me show you what I make with bread. He took the bread, he crumpled <clears> it. <throat> he like toasted it, crumpled it so that he had bread dust. Then he turned it into pasta. Then he made pasta. He was like, this is my dish. And everyone was like, genius. I was like, make oh, they, pasta. He, they, like, they bread's liked, not the hero. They liked it? Yeah. Because he was the like the, he was the guest judge for that day or whatever. The guest judge? Oh, so he wasn't even... He wasn't a contestant. He was doing like a demonstration. Yeah. He made the bread into pasta. So he made the bread disappear. Yeah, and yeah. then he was like, I truly hero the bread. And then this lady made bread pudding, and they were like, there's not enough bread. But she had made bread pudding and put a bread crumble on top. And they were like, so, I can't taste the bread. And I was like... But you could taste it in the pasta? I know, I was like, but that guy made pasta! And then she went home for it. It was a trick. Okay, well, spoilers. This um, is from the 2021 season of MasterChef the Australia. 2021 <laughs> season of MasterChef Australia. <laughs> I was so mad. <laughs> These are one of those where they like pan fry and it gets mm. like the flat disc shape. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I love that. I love that too. Like this. Yeah. You see what I'm talking about? Yeah, dude. Those little gyozas that come together. No, I'm talking about like this. Oh, I've never seen that. Yeah. That's that looks delicious. Like a hockey puck. Like a puck. Like a pump punk punkling. Punk, Am I punk. eating a hot dog after the stream? I, I think so. You keep talking about it. If you them. make hot dog, I will also eat a hot dog. I am I I will eat anything. Let's do it. Cause you didn't have lunch, right? Well, I had I had like a snack before I left, but I was expecting again. I I I did a bad plan. Well, I did a bad train plan. I, that wasn't I assumed your fault. the trains would be not uh, <laughs> fucking around. I assumed they would just sort of run like normal, which yeah is is never. You should never do that. It's not a, never a safe assumption. You should always do a little Google and be like, mm -hmm. does the train that I expect to run to all of the stations feel like making all of its stops today? Yeah. Um, Often, I, if it's the weekend, the answer is absolutely not. Yeah, I think I thought since it's still Friday's a sort of a, a weekday. Yeah. That, and like usually this stuff happens starts friday night if it's a weekend change right but they they were like no you forgot that the subway fridays. was stuck in the server slam server slam yeah everybody they can't <laughs> they can't take me from the the last few stops on the train because the conductors are all grinding grinding their characters yeah too busy going, ooh, which class would I be? Yeah, ooh, let's get some more epic loot drops. <laughs> Dude, Hello, fellow kids. I can't wait for epics loot drops. I want the epic, the most epic loot to drops for me. And then I will wear them and make my build. I will get the special 
build for my character. Brioche best bread? I disagree. Like an enriched dough? What's the best bread? Best bread. Um, if I'm talking like the if I'm eating the bread by itself, it's gonna be a a delicious focaccia. Yeah. Mm, yeah. It's as got a, a lot solo of, bread, it's as hard a solo to solo bread. Yeah, the, it's got some. It's probably got some some garlic, some herbs, some mm -hmm. olive oil, some olive oil. Yeah, mm -hmm. you don't need. Yeah, if it's just if it's just the bread, nothing else. Mm. That's pretty good. There's a place that Jacob and I on a burner. Yeah, there's a place that Jacob and I order from sometimes, and they do a, a, a eggplant parm on a pretzel bun. Ooh, pretzel bun! Pretzel bun really makes a difference on that sandwich. I do like a pretzel bun. But yeah, I think focaccia is the best bread by itself. It's pretty good. I like I like a challah, as well. Sure. But it, again, that's not. You're not you're not getting slammed in the in the face with flavor the way you are with a focaccia. Yeah, I think uh, I think you I think you got it in one there, Jacob. I love a good baguette, but oh, sure. Sometimes that'll real scrape up the roof of your mouth. If it's nice and crusty. Mm -hmm. Yeah, baguette. If you catch the baguette when it's shining, it's brightest. It's a wonderful experience. Yeah. But if you wait, God help you if you wait 30 <laughs> seconds too long to eat that baguette, it becomes a rock. Yeah, it's true. It doesn't become a weapon. It becomes a weapon. It becomes a rock. Yeah. You got to be on your shit if you want to eat a baguette. Oh, croissant's also great. Croissant. 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 What about pain au chocolat? But that's like more of a pastry. Yeah, I would say so. I mean, it's a croissant. <clears throat> Once you add chocolate, it's no longer just bread. That's what I say. Then it's chocolate bread. Chocolate. Isn't that bread. what I said I would do for the bread challenge on MasterChef? Is that I would take a baguette and put a bar of chocolate in it and hand that to them? You did say that, yeah. Yeah, and you said that's not cooking. We need to talk about what cooking is. Yes, we had. We need to have a discussion <laughs> about what constitutes cooking. Well, what if you? Okay, what if you? I'm you, done by the you way. Cr you crumbled the bread. Price. Uh huh. You crumble the bread and and. What and, if I toast the bread and you and you mixed it in with the chocolate and then spread the bread chocolate on more bread, and then made it into a pasta. If I toast the bread, that means I technically cooked something. Mm hmm. I'll grant you that. So if I cut it lengthwise and then I I put instead of sliding the chocolate in, and then. Smush it. That's cooking. That's cooking. That is cooking, but I don't think it's going to get you the win on Master <laughs> Chef, unfortunately. You don't know? You haven't had an entire bar of chocolate with a baguette? Dipped in a coffee, in a little bowl of coffee? Mm. 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 Uh, what would people like to see me, Nathan, draw? It's him, Nathan. It's me, Nathan. Him's the Nathan. Everyone's still appreciating these good dumplings. Thanks, everyone. I'm glad you like them. I did them for you. Present for you. And then I'm going to come to your house in like a month. I'm going to be like, hmm, I noticed those frog dumplings I got you. I don't see them anywhere. Right. You, you liked them, right? Yeah. You told me you liked them, but yet they're not. You don't have them out? The little Gerudo guy. Who is? Yeah, draw yourself. Draw myself in... as the as the little as Gerudo, the little guy, Gerudo that guy, guy I talked about before. Yeah. Okay, let me look up some Gerudo. Draw yourself in the Zelda universe. I'm excited to play that. Copyright claimed. Monday. Because I can't play it this weekend because of the server slam. <laughs> we should talk about that, by the way. We should work out the server yeah. slam, the plans. Okay. So tomorrow. 8 a.m. 8 a.m. Server slam. We're going to show up at Nathan's house with our computers. <laughs> 
Mm-hmm. What would you do, Nathan? If you showed up at my house with your computers, yeah, yeah I'd be excited to see you at eight a.m. <laughs> at eight a.m. Oh, I'd be asleep. <laughs> we but would not be allowed we're, in. We're laying on the doorbell. Yeah, we're, um, we're leaning on a buzzer. I guess I, I guess I buzz you in. I guess I buzz you in to make you stop buzzing, and then I go back to sleep, <laughs> and I'm like, you, you, do what you want. What do you want? Right, so I'm, I'm just a little guy. I'm just like, what if I? Have you ever just been a little guy? What if I turn down the stabilizer? I've definitely felt like a little guy. Oh, that's much better for me and, and my, and myself. You could do whatever you want with it. I'm always what's, saying this. What's the? Did Gerudos have pointy ears? Yes. They do got pointy ears. Everybody yeah. got pointy ears over there. Yeah. Everyone's got pointy ears. Everybody's got the pointy ears. Do Gorons? Gorons don't even have ears, really. Right? They have like little holes in the side of their head. What if they had like the little Shrek tubes? You asked if Gorons have pointy ears. I want you to imagine in your mind how insane it would look if Gorons had pointy ears. Well. Their entire motif is being round. Yeah, but then they have like the little... Sometimes they have little spikies. Yeah, but just imagine them chills. with point. It would change their whole vibe if they had pointy ears. Yeah. <laughs> really pathetic noise outside. Oh, I love a little top knot situation. Yeah, it's to sort of match my my beard. Is it also going to be tied up? Ooh, it should be, yeah. So it creates perfect vertical symmetry? Perfect vertical symmetry. <sighs> when your ahead. hair is, like, longer, you could probably do this. Yeah. In real life. It wouldn't look this cute. But but it would look pretty crazy. <laughs> yeah. It would look pretty crazy. It would look pretty crazy. You're right. And maybe it could be a look. You know how I caused controversy by saying that Twilight Princess is bad? Yes. Here's yeah. another reason as to why Twilight Princess is bad. I googled Goron. You're going to cause more controversy? Yeah. Maybe, yeah. This stream is not free from controversy. I googled Goron. I got this. <laughs> oh, I forgot oh, about the yeah. Gorons in Twilight Princess. Oh, boy. They're so bad. He doesn't have to look like that. He doesn't got to look like that. <laughs> <laughs> That's just his Should body. I hold him up to the camera? That's just his yeah. body, though. I don't... I can't... I, mean, I, I don't... I didn't... I've only ever played breath of the wild so i really i don't have any opinions on the other games look at him it's like if you played a game and really didn't like it like that's that's valid you don't you don't have to like it all zelda games were like we're not we're not going to address nipples and then in twilight princess they were like give the gorons crusty nipples in twilight princess they gave everything nipples yeah they put nipples on everything in that game yeah they couldn't they, that, stop that, themselves. That was for someone. That's where all someone of, liked that. Part. All of Zelda's nipples they had been holding back up until that time. They let them all out. They gave Mario nipples in Odyssey. What and then they of, took them away. What do you think about they took them? Like, <laughs> remember what they took from us? <laughs> <laughs> the Mario nipples. What are their What are their eyes doing? Yeah, they still got like these cool sort of like. This is how I felt when I saw that Twilight Princess Goron. That's a very good face. I like that one. Here you go. <laughs> That's how I felt. Thank you. I find this character charming so far. Yeah. I find myself charmed. Yeah, you and all the giant ladies. This little guy looks like me. he'd be like the gopher for the Gerudos. When they need to like talk to someone outside the village, they send this little guy out. Yeah. They wouldn't send one of their males out. Yeah. Well, there's no men allowed in the village. They make an exception for me because they love me so much. <laughs> there's like no Gerudo men, period, 
other yeah. than Ganondorf. Yeah, and me. And Nathan. <laughs> That's my name. But they're not going to be like, yeah, go out there and go do whatever. They're like, no, we need to keep you close at hand. We're putting you in the compound. Yeah. <laughs> we don't know when we're getting another one. They don't really seem bothered by it, though, the Gerudo. They're like, oh, we'll figure it out. And they always do. I think They've that's beautiful. They've lasted this long. All right, the Okus. Never mind, Twilight Princess is good. Wow. I forgot about those well, guys. Well, they also have nipples in it. Yeah? <laughs> yeah. They put nipples on them, too. Oh, God. Never mind. It's bad. Yeah, it's really bad. Oh, no. It's one of the worst things they've ever designed. What Hands the down. hell? This is like a Giger. This looks like a little, a little Giger guy. Justin Giger? Justin Giger. Oh, they're based off of a surreal creature from an M.C. Escher painting. Yeah, I like these guys, though, because they don't have nipples. They couldn't stop themselves. Well, it's like once you put <laughs> nipples on one thing... And it's like, why why don't they... You've established a precedent. Here's yeah. the other thing about this: the, the, the birds. I have nipples, Greg. Remember that? I remember that. Remember these that these from... birds have eight nipples. All up the neck. Yeah, they do have just like a, a titty stack coming from chin to, to tummy. Yeah. And there's no, they no, didn't have to do that. They didn't that. have to do it like that, but they did. And I'm proud of them for sticking to their guns. I love this pose. It's like, I'm here. I'm the little Gerudo guy. I'm not a threat. I've already poisoned your melon. <laughs> Why would birds have nipples? That's eight too many nipples for a non-milking, milk-producing animal. Yeah, that's what we're saying. Well, no one knows if they produce milk. No one's tried. They don't want to They're touch cowards. them. Wow, you're really wow, small. you're so small. Yeah, I'm a little guy. They're really big, and I'm really small. I wasn't and, expecting and you I'm to be a... like a foot tall. Well, I'm. How tall are they? The Gerudos? Yeah, they're pretty tall. They're really tall. They're probably like seven feet tall. Gerudo. We can make them. Let's you know. Let's be reasonable. You're acting crazy right now. Let's be reasonable. Okay. Let's, okay. Let's let's. A let's... typical Gerudo stands over six feet tall. Okay. Oh. That's not even that. that we're talking that tall. tall girl. Yeah, that's just tall girl from Netflix. Okay. Okay. We'll make it like this. Oh my god, someone did the math. Hold on. In Breath of the Wild. So Urbosa is roughly seven foot five in heels. And she is seven foot two without the heels. She's huge though. She's Massive. Huge. Absolute unit. Boom, bing, 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 bing. I can't believe the math breakdown this person on Tumblr did. I can believe it. Person on Tumblr did a breakdown. It's <laughs> a good point. They counted the pixels. How many pixels were there? <laughs> well, okay. Link is 122 pixels tall. Urbosa is 175 pixels tall. And Urbosa's heels are six pixels. There's a 53 pixel difference. They didn't have to do this. They didn't have to do this. And yet here I am reading and appreciating their, their Tumblr post math. As long as they had fun. Yeah. That's what I care about. There are worse things to spend your time on. Very much so. 
like watching this stream. Am I right, patrons? Oh my god! Thanks for being a patron. Thanks Thank for, being for being a patron, being a patron and wasting your time with us. You could be playing Zelda. Could be playing Zelda. But we told you to put them down, so you can't. Yeah, you wouldn't still be <clears> playing <throat> it if we asked you to put it down, right? Yeah, we asked you to put it down, so. I don't think you would disrespect us in that fashion. Mm -hmm. I trust you, chat. Yeah. She's about to just punt this little dude. I miss my Zelda. No, she loves it. I miss my wife. You look like you could do a flip. Yeah, I could. Okay. I'm glad to know that. Jacob, did you want your drink? No, I'll get to it later. Wow. Do you want hot dog water? I'm going to make uh, Nathan and I some hot dogs after this. Do you want the water? Would you like the water? If I don't want the water, I'll probably have a hot dog. Do you... That wasn't the question. Yeah, that wasn't the question or a, a possibility for you. It wasn't offered. You question my dominion over the kitchen <laughs> realm? It's a good point. Nathan, here's a question for you. Mm -hmm. Here's a question for you, Nathan. Mm -hmm. Do you like a toasted bun? Yeah. Mm. Me too. I do like a toasted bun. I like bun. a toasted bun. Do you like a grilled or boiled hot dog? Which one do you prefer? Prefer? Mm -hmm. Like I like a, a I like a backyard barbecue hot dog is sort of my my jam, but obviously I will take whatever mode of of hot dog you're you're offering to me. We have a tiny griddle. We do have a griddle. <laughs> we could get the grill lines on the hot dog. Ooh, if we were Ooh, feeling sassy. Yeah. For sure. Are we feeling sassy? We can do it like they they do it <laughs> on the Discovery Channel <laughs> at Five Guys, again, no. where we, <laughs> we <laughs> split it in half. Oh yeah, you split Ooh, it. Oh, I do like a I do like a a, a butterfly a scored a butterfly dog, and then you put it in the cast iron or on oh, a flat my top. Gosh, yeah, that sounds great. Get a sear on it. You want a little split doggy? I can make you a split doggy. But then you won't have hot dog water. <laughs> no one wants yeah, hot dog water. I don't water. think. I think the. Yeah. I mean. I think. I think if we're talking about like if we're if we're doing the bit, I do want the hot dog water. But if we're talking about actually doing hot dogs after, I would. Uh, I, I, the hot dog water is not an important aspect. I have to make cookies after this too. Ooh, I made what the about the dough. cookie water? Cookie water. Are we gonna have any boiled, cookie water? Some uh -huh. boiled cookies? Yeah. I'll boil some cookies. Is there any reason you couldn't boil a cookie? I mean, I think it would disintegrate the. Yeah, I don't know that the cookie dough is, is meant to be boiled. Is yeah. there a way? But I'm saying, like, if we were tasked with making a boiled cookie. I think you could, like, put it in a little bag. What if you like approached it like a like a southern style dumpling where you make like a sweet dough mm -hmm. with flavorings and and you know chocolate chips in it or whatever and you drop it into a water and boil it that way would that be a boiled cookie? <laughs> I think that's your answer. Wow, that's truly so loud. I win the boiled cookie prize. <laughs> You've done it. I you can't said the I'm... secret word, boiled <laughs> cookie. Boiled cookie. Come on down. Come on down. <laughs> <laughs> they're still, God, they're still, it's still out going. There. I really hope they drive away soon. Yeah, I'm going to. Uh... Invite them up. We have to keep talking so that we Come don't on get up. content ID'd by whatever Come song is playing. Come on up. This is the party. Where are you going? I don't even know. They're, they're, better, gone. Better. they're gone. They're leaving. Um, all right. Someone said, do people actually boil their hot dogs? I prefer my hot dogs boiled. 
Get a nice snap. Marble it's like snap? a ballpark dog. Yeah, I mean, that's how they serve them up on the street. Yeah, I mean, I, yeah. I'm not opposed to it. I just, if given the option. I think they got them in the hot dog water. I think I prefer a non-wet dog. A non-wet dog? That's a New York experience. I know. I, listen. I think that's you're, why I like it. You're offering me dogs. I will take them however you want to make them. But you asked me my, my preference. And in a vacuum, I think... I my preferred dog is a is sort of a backyard barbecue vibe. <laughs> Someone said that feels absolute rock bottom to me. <laughs> Why? Yeah, I mean Way. boiled hot dogs are good. They they get they get they plump up. Yeah. And so then when you bite into them, they get a real juicy you know, snap. They do a little they do a little pop. A little juicy snap. You get the hot dog water. Uh, anyway, this is this is my little Gerudo man. I love him. He love he loves it. I love yeah. him and he loves it. And Perfect. And we love you, chat. Should I do the last ten minutes? Yeah, please. Okay. Please do. I'm begging you. Please. Please. Julia. I'm here. Hi, everyone. Please. Please. Sorry, I fucked up the. How dare you? The layers. I'm pretty excited to have a hot dog. Yeah. Now that we've been talking about them. Yeah. Are knowing gonna, that it's an option, we are have. Are you gonna do the, the 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 cut down the the butterfly cast iron? I was gonna ask you what you if what that you so wanted. That sounded really good to me. If that's then that's what we're gonna do. Then that's, that's what we'll do. If that's okay. It's okay with me. Because you get the cast iron all hot, you can toast the bun right in there too. Exactly. That's the plan. Yeah. That's the plan, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 Hot dog link. That's <laughs> funny. That's a funny play on words. Oh, like a sausage link. Yeah, hot dog link. Ah-ha-ha. Ah ha ah yeah, Oh, yeah. I like, Ooh. obviously, a, a brat or a... Or like one of them, one of them other sausages. I think is a uh, is good. Also, a hot dogs a very specific sort of sort of vibe. Yeah, you don't eat a hot dog when you want a sausage, and you don't eat a sausage when you want a hot dog. They're yeah. two separate desires. Yeah, they're similar. Oh. Yeah, they're adjacent, but they're not the same. Ooh, ghostly. Someone took a blurry photo of this guy. Of this guy screaming. He's like, are He's you sure the, it's in focus? The worst day of his life. Hey, are you taking a picture of me? Hot dog. Hot dog. Hot, hot dog, dog water. water. This is the hot dog water guy. Hot dog water is best for tea. <laughs> That's... <laughs> That's <laughs> no, no, <laughs> no, hear, no, hear me out. Hot dog water is best for tea. That's, that's <laughs> this is so you walking away from this man arguing that vile. hot dog water. What a vile thing he's to say. Like, he's, he's like, I like to imagine he's making this face, but he's saying it in like a very reasoned tone. He's like, no, hear me out. Hot dog water is best for tea. Like you, you see him on the corner and people are, are walking away from him, but but you don't, you don't, you have to get close enough to hear what he's saying. Yeah, before you also will walk away. Because he's like, I'm just, I'm just trying to have a reasoned debate here. And Listen, the water's already hot. The water's already hot. It's already got flavor in it. I so, like, so it's better than so normal it's better water. better than normal water. You've already cooked the hot dog. You have hot dog and tea together. And you just use the water. Use the same water. The, the flavor same water carries the, through. It, it's good. Someone said that the blurriness makes him feel like they're passing out while hearing this. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. You're passing out and this man's just like, okay, but. You're dismissing me, but you haven't refuted any of my points. Everything I've said is true. It's factual. Okay, but you haven't, you haven't tried it. Is one of, and I'm saying you should just try you it. You should try it, but also everything, I, all of the reasons I'm giving are good. I think I'm just going to draw... <laughs> Like a summer porfo. Summer porfo, having a blast. 
Summer Porpo happened so fast. Summer Porpo eating the beach. Everyone got in his mouth. Oh, uh, uh, and he swallowed him up. Wow, 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 wow. Tell me more, tell me more. Did he eat your grandma? <laughs> 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 yeah he's eating a hot dog he's eating a hot dog w eating a hot dog with a truly insane choice of grip he's eating it like this <laughs> <laughs> well, that's gonna be taken out of context no why would it <laughs> he's going across he's Wait, but he has a backwards thumb? Yeah, that's just how Porfo's hand goes. <laughs> that didn't fix it, Julia. <laughs> well, yeah, that kind of... That didn't fix it. Go like... I I thought it was... he. I thought it was good. Yeah, I thought it was fine that he was eating the hot dog I, that way. It was way. funny. I just thought it was funny. It was funny. Speaking of eating the beach, you excited for the Meg 2? I never saw the Meg 1. Neither did I, but the trailer for the Meg 2, it, it does eat what looks like a whole beach worth of people. Wow, that's a lot of people. And ambitious. That's, and that's just in the trailer, so who knows how many more people it, it gets. It gets everyone but Jason Statham. He's the only man strong enough to not get eaten by the giant shark. Because he's too cranked. He's too cranked. Yeah, is, is, is the Meg an unofficial sequel to Crank? Is he Chef Jellios? Every Meg... movie he's in is in the Crankiverse. Yeah. Is this the hot, hot... dog water guy? Is he, is he, he's Shaw, right? Or is he Hobbs? He's Shaw. He's Shaw. Hobbs is the Rock. Hobbs is the Rock, but Shaw is is he changed his name from Chev Chelios to Shaw. Yeah, it's but reasonable. It's, but he's the same. He's the same man. He's still cranking, isn't he? <laughs> he's still cranking. But what did you do with the hot dog water? <laughs> this guy's like a single issue voter. Yeah, I mean, he's like the kind of guy who drives around uh, New York City with like a big truck. Oh, he's way more, he's in focus now. You know, and then on the side, it's like, but consider hot dog water. Yeah. <laughs> he parks his hot dog water truck in the parks and yeah. ruins everybody's day. I've drawn nothing. Well, no, never mind. I drew the count. <laughs> I was like, well, I've drawn we'll nothing good to today. Count. One drop of hot dog water. Two drops of hot dog water. Three. Three drops of hot dog water. Eh, it's eh, not a lot of hot eh. dog water. I can't, The drops are pretty big. Okay, so he is gripping it like this. Yeah. That's just how Porfo eats hot dogs. <laughs> <laughs> to even get it in your hand like that would take some doing. He, he picks it up with one hand and puts, and puts it, it in his other hand. Yeah. How do you eat it? Oh, uh, like Julia, this? you have him like this. Yeah. Is this uh, how you uh, eat uh, a hot uh, dog? Uh, 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 I think so. It's definitely not how you eat a hot dog. I feel like you go like this. You go like this, or you you pick it up from the top. Oh yeah, you can sort of. No, but then you get all the the schmutz on you. You get schmutz. You don't put your hand in the toppings. <laughs> yeah, but it's like. <laughs> <laughs> Chad, how do you eat a hot dog? Leave it in the comments. When we make hot dogs after this, I'm gonna be watching. <laughs> you better eat the hot dog like this. He makes the hot dog upside down before picking it up. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> Do what's right for you. There's no wrong way to eat a Reese's or a hot dog. I disagree. 
Um, yeah, Jacob's on the corner next to the hot dog water guy being like, you're eating it wrong. I have my own truck that says, <laughs> eat the hot dog right. It. Hold it the right Hold way. Hold it the right way. Server slam shirt. <laughs> 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 Why would there be a shirt? <laughs> it's just here to promote the server slam. It's just, it's just a shirt. It's a custom shirt that he got made that just says server slam that he wears whenever there's a server slam for any game. I mean, this is the first time I've heard the term server slam. I don't know if it's common terminology. Whoa. Oh, oh Dutch, God. Dutch oh, angle. No. <laughs> How do I reset it? It's just people are talking about it. What if I just keep going? You'll get back to it eventually you if you keep going. Right round, baby, right round, like a record, baby, right round, round, round. Nice. <laughs> there it is. I meant to hit enter, and instead I hit the quotation marks, and it rotated a little bit. That's fun. The canvas. Um, we gotta go make hot dogs. The hot dog yeah. water is going to spill. <laughs> <laughs> no, the centrifugal force keeps it. Yeah, keeps it safe. Yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. Thanks for hanging with us on this beautiful summer's day. Yeah. We hope you all get the hot dog water you need. Yeah. After this, <laughs> and thank you for supporting us on Patreon. Thank you so much. We really appreciate it. We yeah. could not do this show without your support because of your Truly. support when we post episodes that don't get as many numbers <laughs> we don't have to worry we, as much we don't freak about out. our careers ending yeah because we have the stability that you offer us yeah thank you it lets us try stuff yeah and so, that's beautiful um, so thank you yeah truly deeply thank you so much to everyone who supports us on patreon we, we really uh, appreciate it and if you're watching the vod later Consider it, get, you know, getting in there. You, if, could, if you can, you could have been here live for the hot dog water if can, talk. If you can, if you want, if you can, but also like and subscribe and sharing all that stuff mm -hmm. is helpful too. So thank you. Yeah. Thank yeah. You thank you all so much. Uh, we'll see you back on Monday, unless you watch Secret Sleepover Society, which will be streaming on Sunday. Wow. But. Otherwise, Dropy will be back for a regular stream on Monday, and then there's a draw class, if you're part of the draw class here. Draw class is next Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern Time. Uh, Karina and Jacob are going to be doing a guided practice of figure drawing. That sure sounds, are. That sounds like a lovely time. If you participate in that stream, you will get better at drawing figures. That's a guarantee. That's a yep. guarantee. All right, we're out of here. Bye-bye. Bye, everyone. Thanks, everyone. Sorry.